Here's a segment we're calling Inside the NL East. How did you come up with the title? Well, it's pretty clear. We're just going to talk about the nationally Eastern Division. Two 100-win teams, Braves and Mets, both win 101. They finished tied, statistically at least. The Braves, by virtue of the tiebreaker, won the division. Phillies went all the way to the NLCS with 87 wins. Marlins feature great pitching. Nationals are in rebuild mode once again in 2023 as we look forward to that. Welcome back inside. Uh, let's get back Oof. into this division because at least the top three teams, yep. the Phillies, Mets, and Braves, have all made big deals this winter so far. Trades, free agent signings, and I have some questions for you to try to figure out which of those teams has asserted themselves as the okay. chalk now, if we can say such a thing. Which NL Eastern Division team did the most to improve themselves so far this winter? I mean, clearly the Mets. You know, you look at, they signed three starting pitchers. I mean, you go get the Cy Young Award winner in the American League, you bring over the Sanjay from Japan, you bring back. What was his I, name? I don't know what the heck his name is. <laughs> the Sanjay? No. I said Sinja. <laughs> we'll do it later. There, I'm, I, you know what I did? I was trying to follow the video. I didn't know they were going to just chop his stuff up. So I'm trying to speak quick with the video. I got you. What? Forget that. I know. I got but it. you look at what, what they did. They signed the three pitchers that they brought in. I believe there was three. Yeah, three starters. And then you go get Nemo, bring him back. Yep. I, I don't know. I just feel like – and they still got more work to do. So I think so far they've done pretty All good. All right. Job. Okay, I'll push back a little because you're probably right. But with the Phillies adding Trey Turner, he was the best player yep. on the market on both sides of the scorecard that wasn't Aaron Judge. True. In fact, I'd make a case that he's a, a better fit for some teams than even Aaron Judge would be. Younger, he runs. This guy's skill set and his athleticism is unmatched. They, they did some other things, too, which were pretty nice, like bringing in Taiwan Walker. Don't sleep on that. Nice. I think the Phillies did a pretty good job. They added to their bullpen with Matt Strom. Like, I, the Phillies added one guy and made a huge So, uh, let me ask you this. With the injured Bryce Harper, okay. are the Phillies better now than they were at the end of the year in the World Series? Man, I'm, I mean, with Turner and without Harper until a date that's undetermined, um, they're not worse. Let's put it that way. And when Harper plays again this year, and I, I, he'll play at some Lost point. Lost Robertson. That's who else I forgot they brought. I, that's okay. To the Mets as well. I mean, well. great player, good dude, but that that's not going to make them any worse. They, there's other pieces out there. Uh, let's go on to the next question here regarding okay. the NL East, and you kind of intimated at this a moment ago. Which pitching staff, which rotation that Oh, is, that's is easy. I just said it. I best. just repeat what I said. Okay. You look at the Mets rotation. Go ahead and throw the board up there if you have it. I'm not even trying to say any names. But uh, <laughs> look, anytime you have DeGrom and Scher I mean, uh, you have Scherzer and Verlander at the top of your rotation, I will take my chances. Yeah. I know. It's hard, it's hard to see anything but the Mets. But again, just to suggest, okay. uh, with, you know, with Bailey Falter pitching pretty well during this regular season for the Phillies and Ranger Suarez kind of arriving – in the postseason, the Phillies' rotation is very good. Come on. It's it's probably doesn't have the kind of marquee name pop that the Mets do, but I, I like Phillies' rotation. And we I think we'd be remiss if we didn't mention the Marlins in the, some capacity. Yeah, I like the Marlins' rotation. But the, the one thing I don't see with the Phillies' rotation, and it ended up biting them in the postseason, that's a bullpen team. You know, my starter gets me to five, seven innings, and here comes my pin. Yeah. For except for with the exception maybe two of those the, the top two starters. I would have felt better with Wheeler and also with uh, Nola. Yeah, I would have felt much better <laughs> advocating for the Phillies had they kept Zach Eflin. Right? Yep. That's a big loss for them. It's a huge loss. Big piece. Let's move on to the next question about the NL East. Which lineup is the scariest? Now that's a good one. That's that's debatable. Not an easy answer, right? No. Um, I, I I would kind of go either Phillies or Braves. Yeah. To me, um, the Phillies. If you have Bryce Harper healthy, that's the you, then it's over the top Phillies for me because Trey Turner changes everybody in that lineup. I can move 
Swerver out of the top and put him anywhere else? I mean, I, I love this group. Uh, that's again, good. that's a projection, and there's nothing not to love about this group either. And I'm not sure where Sean Murphy will end up settling in. This is a, you know, kind of a research-driven guess. I don't see Darno being there at the end of the day. Well, one of those guys is going to yeah. DH. You know, they've got Von Grissom penciled in at shortstop just because we didn't put Dansby in the lineup. I, 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 how about if you end up having uh, Nelly Cruz be your DH on that team? Wow, that's an intriguing thought. I mean, you're going to get him for uh, and, and, you know what if Dansby comes explosive. back? If Dansby comes back, it's I think it's a pick 'em between the Braves and the Phillies. Really? I mean, I I couldn't pick one being better than the other. Well, if Dansby comes back, then the Braves are fun little well, exercise. Yeah, good division. It's, it's good. been fun watching those teams kind of uh, you know manipulate for good. position here.